joining us. Now, for Ubisoft, VR is the perfect technology for making gaming more accessible. And Ubisoft Montreal's Funhouse team built a game that just about everyone is going to know how to play the minute they put on their headsets. So here to take us into the world of Eagle Flight, please welcome creative director Xiao Hu Do, along with two huge fans of the game, Paul Merlucky, inventor and founder of Oculus, and Jason Holtman, head of publishing at Oculus VR. Okay, great job. Hello, everyone. I am very excited to show you the game today, and even more excited to have you guys to play with us. Thanks for having us. Uh, we're really huge fans of Eagle Flight. It's a very, very intuitive game. And the, uh, the, the flight mechanic is super innovative, and it gives you that real freedom of flying in VR. But most of all, it's just super fun. And by super fun, I mean I can beat Palmer almost every time I play. That's, that, that, that's not true. Um, <laughs> but I mean, we've been playing this game for months at Oculus, and we've been getting pretty good at it. And uh, So this is a really good chance for us to come and show everybody that we can beat you guys at your own game. Yeah. Let's see what you've got, Palmer. Let's, Let's play. Let's go. Let's go. Hello everyone, my name's Carsten Myhill and I'm going to talk you through for the first time ever at E3 a live PvP demo in VR. It's called Capture the Prey and two teams of three will battle it out in the skies over Paris. Over here we have the blue team resplendent in their Hawaiian shirts led by Palmer Lucky, Olivier and Vicky and the red team led by Jason Hawkman with his two wingmen Andre and Charlie. The rules are simple, it's a capture the flag game and we will play best of three. So if we're ready to go, let's fly. So we can see the first location of the prey, right there at the foot of the Eiffel Tower, and they have to take it to the nest to score a point. It's a bit like football, they have to work as a team, taking the object and bringing it to a goal. All right, maybe not the greatest analogy in the world, but you get the idea. Teamwork is key to succeeding in this game. Paris has been reclaimed by nature. We can see the Champ de Mar uh, overrun now with uh, beautiful trees and undergrowth and nature and the escaped animals from the zoo, like those giraffes over there. Olivier has the rabbit and is making his way over to the nest right now. He's trying to stay low, using shortcuts, weaving in and out of the trees taking little alleyways and tunnels wherever he can, trying to stay out of sight of his opponents who are trying to, trying to shoot him. Oh, and he's been hit by Andre. And the rabbit is down. Charlie's got it. So the red team in possession. Oh, no. Killed by Vicky. Who's going to pick it up? They're not far from the nest now. And it's Olivier for the blue team. Yeah! There's the nest. Are blue going to score first? Yes, they are. 1 0 to the blue team. Yeah, what well a guy. OK, remember, it's best of three, so the red team need to score to stay in the contest. Oh, Vicky with an amazing steal and then flew right into the line of sight of Andre, who took it from her into the tunnels, utilizing gusts of winds and thermals to get a speed boost. Andre looks like he's got a bit of a free run at the moment. Someone shooting at him though. Andre staying low, Jason being wingman, backing him up. Over to the Pantheon there. Oh, great kill by Jason on Olivier. Oh, no. But Andre has it for the red team, 1-1! One, one. Well done. Don't high-five each other, that's not going to work. OK, the final location is right there at the top of the Eiffel Tower. Don't ask me how the oh. rabbit got up there. It's an extremely <laughs> exposed position. We'll see them shooting at each other as they head up to try and get that final rabbit to win the game. Yeah! Palmer with a kill, good work. And Andre's down, great shot of Vicky taking him out there. Vicky inside the Eiffel Tower, utilizing the thermals. But 
Jason with the ram against the final score. No! Vicky with the steal. Okay, we have to chase on to get to that final nest. Not far to go now. Andre with it for the red team. Taken out just at the final moment. And the blue team with the steal right at the end to win the game. Well done, blue team. And uh, keep on playing. Sorry, guys, we're going to have to stop now. For those of you here, you can come to the Ubisoft booth and the Oculus booth to try it out yourselves. So we'd love to come and see you down there. Thanks very much. Have a great E3.